It's that time again, Kanye album release night, or so we think at least. A lot has happened over the past week, including Ye releasing a date for Vultures Volume 2, allegedly getting sued by Drake and pretty much everyone else at Yeezy, new music videos, and way more info on the new album and rap in general, so let's get into it. Also, subscribe and like if you haven't already for more rap news and content on my channel. Okay, first, let's talk about arguably, probably the biggest thing to come from this week, Kanye dropping the Vultures 2 release date, very nonchalantly too. May 3rd release and low-key plug, live stream listening party tonight night 11 30 p.m est my channel on youtube so the release will it happen what proof is there to show that this is going to happen and is there a possible track list for this thing many insiders are saying the next 24 hours which at the time of recording this is the day before the album is set to drop is very crucial and that has been a very hectic day at Yeezy headquarters, which makes sense considering I still have not received my pods in the mail. It's been two months, Kanye. Please give me my pods. But it makes sense that it is hectic from a lot of the things that we have seen. Use the Kanye News website is completely down for the first time. And one of the people who run it, probably the worst guy at Yeezy, Milo, put out a goofy ass letter about how he cannot associate with Kanye. So sorry to the three use users, but it had to happen. It's a good thing. I I'd sacrifice use for Milo. I could not care less about use, to be honest. I'm just happy Milo is gone, like I said. A lot of the community is speculating that this outage could also mean that the platform is just moving to the new Yeezy app which has been in the works for a long time now and this actually does have to kind of do with music so stay with me. If this does all get moved to the app it does kind of worry me a little bit because we know that it has been floated around for a while that Kanye does not want to drop any music on streaming platforms especially along with the fact that he can't just do whatever he wants on them in regards to things like sample clearances and getting paid obviously. We saw it with Good Don't Die he used the sample even though the owner said no, and now the hooligans like that remix with Kanye keeps getting taken down by different labels. It's obviously very frustrating for Kanye when all of this happens, but what does this mean for Vultures 2? Well, it's clear that Kanye is okay with dropping tracks on Yeezy.com along with YouTube as well with the remix, which he also didn't get permission for, I guess. And now the new and original talking music video that leaked months ago before the other one dropped is up on YouTube. More and more things are pointing towards this album actually releasing on Friday, but not on streaming. The last talking music video was also released the same week as Vultures 1 dropping. Along with this, we have seen a lot of Ye affiliates saying that the album is actually coming soon, along with Joy Boy, who has been pretty reliable lately, saying that May 3rd is a lock. But he did also say that the track list was supposed to be here by this morning so that is a little worrying but i guess we'll just have to wait to see how that plays out the only thing missing from all of this to be honest is a listening party and i'm gonna be honest I'm kind of okay with that. It was just getting very boring watching the listening parties, the same thing over and over again, especially when they aren't even performing and they're just walking back and forth on stage, like a blank stage, not even anything interesting. Even when there's new music, it's just like spoiling what the album could be. I don't know. I I'm not a fan of it. I know some people love watching the progress, but me at least, I'd rather have it completely be a surprise. When there is a possible like surprise feature, and now with all the beef going on in the rap game, there is going to be a Drake diss on this album. I can't even imagine who could be on it, and I'd rather be surprised. Especially after the whole possibility of them almost getting sued by him, which is insane. There's not much info on this, but in the Kendrick diss, he revealed that Drake and his team sent out a cease and desist for the Like That remix, which is just going to make everyone go in 10 times harder on the next disc from Kanye. I'm sure the whole Drake suing Kanye will most likely absolutely go nowhere, but I'm really, really excited to see what is to come. And this whole situation and the secrecy of this album, Vultures 2, could give us something like a no parties in LA if we get a secret Kendrick feature on a Drake disc on Vultures 2. I just know that the internet would absolutely blow up and not know how to react. I would not be surprised, honestly, if there was more than one Drake disc on the album. Kanye loves stirring the pot and he does a great job at doing it, so yeah. And also with Drake, Kanye is literally dropping a remix the same day this album is supposed to drop with 4Bats, an artist currently signed to Drake's label OVO, so it's 
it's going to just be interesting to see how this whole entire thing plays out and if this affects vultures 2 dropping as well tonight and back to me saying i don't want a listening party doesn't mean like a hundred percent i don't want one if it had the production of donda and it was like actually good and not what we've been seeing these past few months of them just kind of standing on like a blank stage with smoke which i doubt it will be the same production level as donda but if it did then yes i would want one but what we're getting right now like i said is just lazy and i will die on that hill to be honest i don't think anyone would rather have what we're getting now instead of the high production kanye on fire playboy cardi getting exiled by lightning type of listening party that's pretty much everything for today i really hope you guys enjoyed i'll be streaming the possible album release like i said tonight may 2nd 11 30 p.m est on my channel here on youtube so be sure to join that it will be a great time join my discord as well as following my tiktok and instagram to be a part of the best music community on the internet all of those links will be in the description for you guys like and subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment letting me know what you think of the video. I will reply to everyone who comments. And on that note, 